Christmas. Selamat Bapak Heru Nuguru, Bapak Syedik Purnama, Bapak Profesor Yudo Giri Sucaya, Chairman of Pandi. Dengan izin saya akan melanjutkan dalam bahasa Inggeris. On behalf of Dr. Shabazz Khan, the Director and Representative of UNESCO in Indonesia, good evening to all the participants, virtual and real. It is a great pleasure to participate at the launch of the Connecting uh, the Nation through Ancient Character Digitalization Project, and also to mark the signing of the Letter of Intent between Pandi and UNESCO. Linguistic diversity is an integral part of cultural diversity. It enables women and men to express emotions, intentions, values, and understanding from diverse cultural, social, professional backgrounds. On this basis, it is also essential for dialogue, reconciliation, and peace. Language plays a part in the construction and expression of individual and collective identity. It is intangible, but invaluable resource that is hard to acquire, but once acquired, rewarding to share. For these reasons, it is a cause for serious concern that over 50% of some 6,700 languages spoken today are in danger of disappearing. From almost 2,500 endangered languages listed on UNESCO's Atlas of World's Languages in Danger, 577 are critically endangered languages, and since 1950, more than 230 languages have already become extinct. Many other languages will disappear in the near future. Some of them will lose the relevance at the global, national, or even local level. It is also must be noted that less than 5% of current world languages have its presence online. Therefore, we are very happy to see Pandi's initiative to preserve ancient Indonesia characters and to make them widely available online and on various digital platforms. We also applaud Pandi for its outreach activities, such as the website building competition and its various partnership building initiatives. These will certainly contribute to the long-term sustainability of the actions taken today. These actions are also very much in the same spirit as the UNESCO's recommendation concerning the promotion of the use of multilingualism and universal access to cyberspace adopted back in 2003 that encourages all countries to develop multilingual content and systems to facilitate access to universal systems to develop public domain content to reaffirm the balance between the interests of the rights holder and of public interest. I would like to encourage Indonesia to officially report this initiative as an achievement as part of this recommendation to UNESCO's general conference that will take place in November 2021. Distinguished guests and participants, Every language reflects a unique worldview with its own value system, its own philosophy, and particularly cultural features. The extinction of a language results in irrecoverable loss of unique cultural knowledge embodied in it for centuries. It may include historical, spiritual, ecological knowledge that may be essential for its, the survival not only of its speakers, but for countless others. UNESCO is glad that organizations such as Pandi is working to ensure multilingualism online is not just an ideal, but a reality that will benefit future generations. Once again, it has been my pleasure to be part of this initiative and with that, I end my message today. Thank you very much. And back to the moderators.